guys, welcome to another episode with Dad and Dragon and today this episode is number 24. Hey everyone, this is episode 24, that was Manx doing the intro, well done buddy. Got another fine episode of Foolcraft here today for everyone to enjoy. Got any plans for today's episode? Oh, any crashes. <laughs> well done. <laughs> well, you got the intro done. We're all set. Perfect. You lived long enough. Eh, yeah, well, <laughs> I don't know what's going on there. We've had a lot of issues today. This is probably the third time I've tried, in, tried running the game today. Um, had a bit of a memory leak, I think. There must be a memory leak in one of the mods here. We are still running in a slightly older version than than the top one, only because it's a little bit of a pain to update the server when I need to. And we have added a couple of modders, mods in. You know, we've got embers in here, back in here, due to the crashing from them removing it. But um, it's working. I don't know if Buddy's going to try and come back in. See how you go, Manx. I am trying. Um, I've done a little bit of work, mainly on the mob farm. You can see the, the drawers are missing. Um, and I also realized that um, there's an augment that makes these dynamos run so much better. Uh, it's this one here. This uh, ignition plugs uh, requires electrum and a few other bits and pieces. Not a lot. It's not a real hard one. I am getting it from loot bags, which is the other reason I've done the change to the to the mob farm there um, as you can see there though it says only refined fuel can be used when you use this augment which is fine and you can only put one specialization in. so you can only put one of these in but it's as it says greatly increases power generation and efficiency so a normal one so these two have the augments this one here um, if I click on this you can see maximum power 400 RF tick we've got three of these auxiliary transmission coils no worries Maximum power, 520 RF a tick. So it definitely does put out a chunk more power. Um, very much more, I don't know if it's more efficient. It, it, it seems to use the power from these. I think it stores more too. Yeah, so it stores 520,000 too. So these two alone can hold just over a million RF, which is pretty cool. Right. Um... Uh, the, on the reload, the, the R, RS, refined storage system there, seems to be working all right with that fool's controller. Um, Dragon, you have googly eyes. I know, you do too. How do I? And the crazy sort. Yeah, the ones that change shape and stuff. Yep. I think this one's all a bit derped up again. I've got the factories running because, as I, as I said, I'm, I'm trying to get some loot bags. Um, where is this? Oh, I've got, hey. got magnet mode turned on for some reason. Yes. You know what? You know downstairs? Mm. If I didn't know any better, I'd say you'd be hoarding. Uh, no, never. I wouldn't be hoarding. So, where did I move this stuff? I moved it downstairs. You can see dragons play a tag through the floor. Choik. You were saying? What's wrong with this? It's like a wall of stuff. It is a wall of stuff. Yeah, I'm just glad it isn't the whole room. Well, it could be eventually. You can run these. Eh, probably go a little bit further around the wall. I don't. I don't know how far these go. I might be able to extend it by putting the. Um, I had it up there. By using the controller slaves, I might be able to put a slave over here somewhere or something and let it keep going. Anyway. Uh, so what I've got here is I've got the ender chest that's connected up to the farms upstairs Everything comes into here Underneath I've just got some conduits which I need to eventually speed up um, Got the loot bag opener So this here now there's a filter under here a One of the ones that's a mob one. So if I go a mod one, I should say it's one of these ones mod item filter so underneath there is insert and extract and it's a mod item filter set to loot bags mod. 
So it will pull the loop bags out and throw them in here. Anything else, it will push through into the controller. Round the back of the wall here is the refined storage. Oh, sorry about that. Refined storage wireless receiver and the external storage connector so that my or our system can see everything that's in here. And then it pretty much unpackages everything, throws it into the drawers. Now I've got a couple of chests here and I will expand this a little bit. Um, I've got to work out how to, I don't know, throw things out once this is full. Um, so all the Batania items are coming to this chest. All of the Deco Craft items are coming to this chest. And then this one's got a, a filter in it as well. It allows me to just put stuff in because if you remember we were voiding the bows and I'd forgotten to do that and with all the, the crashing of the client and and things marking around I didn't get a chance to do it and I'll come back on and there was bows everywhere. So we're getting a bit of stuff. Someone. Glowstone chicken. Alright, so things should be cool. We got some chicken eggs, we got some saplings, we got the dodgy cobblestone, a bit of a manamana, manyelin, however you want to say it. Uh, a lot of these drawers are upgraded with at least one emerald level. These ones around this side are not. Haven't got that far yet. But my, my hope is that eventually I'll get enough items to get a few more of those upgrades for the dynamite. And a few other bits and pieces like prismarine. We've got 33 prismarine shards now. We've got some dark steel and some solarium and coal coke and seared bricks. We're getting all sorts of weird and wonderful stuff from these bags. Lots of chicken eggs. Um, not sure whether it's pro whether it's worth getting a gold chest over here and having the chicken the chicken egg stuff go to that. I may do that yet. It probably actually probably wouldn't hurt. I don't know if I've got enough gold though. I'm really, really, really short on gold. I have eleven. Better than none. Let's make another chest. Convert it to an iron one. Got plenty of iron. Probably need to get a gold. Actually, we don't have any gold chickens, do we? I'm going to take this gold chicken. Um, I put a, a hen house in here. Just a, oh. Well, that was that was derpy. Should have gone for the uh, the the nest there. This thing. Apparently, the idea is I can. Can stand on it like I'm laying an egg or something. I don't know whether um, crop dusting helps. Weird. Like I'm sitting on the egg, helping it hatch 2%. I don't know if that's normal speed. 4. 6. My foot fell asleep. Your foot fell asleep? Well, that's no good. Yeah. I've got no arrows. There's a skelly trying to hit me. Hey, buddy. You can die. And your friend over here. And his horse. And I heard an enderman. Don't know where he is. That's an ender mini. Oh, is it? It's an ender deadness. Right. Ha. Huh. So yeah, we got this little system set up and this is just literally to try and get some more bits and pieces. Uh, let's see what I wanted to do. We were working on, hang on, let's, sorry, I was getting sidetracked. Let's do this chest. Oink. Let's do this again. What have we got these ones set to? We have, oink. no, oh, actually I don't have another mod item filter. I'll have to go and get it. So three and Three, yep. So three is what we need to set it to. Let's get a mod item filter. And they are quite simply 
Uh, we're gonna need gonna need some sticks. Uh, quite simply, mod item was it one of these? They're a Yetta wrench, so we need to make a Yetta wrench. Um, let's make two, and then paper. Oops, no, actually make the wrench first. Duh. I'm not sure how much electrical steel I've got, so oh, we've got enough for two. Okay, and then what you will need is something from that mod, so egg. Wow, I've got a lot of eggs in that chest, in the uh, in the system, sorry. So let's, otherwise, yeah, we're gonna run out of room. Let's throw you down. I poisoned Ender Minis to death. How'd you do that? I killed a witch earlier. Oh, and you threw something out. I got wither. I got a wither potion, so I took advantage. Okay then. Insert. Hatchery is a whitelist. Hey, no. Go back here. Alright, so that'll give us the ability for any eggs to go in here. And now what we could do is just get... Really? Can't get good help these days. Isn't this supposed to be something called office pranks? D did we say it was meant to be pranks? Sheesh. You crazy. Who knows? Alright, so let's just get these eggs. I should be able to throw these in here. And they should not go to the drawers. They should go to that chest. So let's just double check. Any more eggs? I don't see any more in here. There probably are a few more, but they should all be in there. And they're not. Have they been pulled out of here? Yep, apparently they just disappeared. No, they're over here. Why? I am back. Oh, that's chickens mod. So not just hatchery. This is We need to do chickens as well. Dirt. So that should go into here. There they are. So I'll do that properly now. I don't know where the eggs actually went. It's interesting. Oh, here they are. Here's some of them. Okay. Yep. So if you see any eggs in the wall of stuff, pull them out and throw them back in the ender chest, please. And then hopefully this will be a little bit cleaner. I know there was more than that. I don't know where they've ended up. But yeah, that, that's the idea is get into, into this system and start sorting. Maybe we can have a wall of gold chests once we get some more gold. Uh, and I can perhaps put out these augments. So just change it so that all thermal expansion stuff goes to a chest or that sort of stuff. Could be cool. All right, what's next? What's next? What's when next? are we getting flying equipment? Uh, you need to make your own. <laughs> Me. No. Um, Meanie. I think I've got part of what you need. Meanie. Okay, we've got a golden lasso with a bat in there. I mean, we could do that. This we could finish that off this episode. Let's let's clean the inventory out. Dump some junk. Um, right. So lasso. Got a cursed lasso and one with a bat. I could probably do with another. What do I need it? I need at least three, don't I? Got one bat, two bats. I'm gonna need lasso. six baseball bats. Baseball bats? You said bats. You didn't specify which one. You are silly. No. Oh, I leave my. Oh, I might be in here. No. Okay. So I need some string and I need some nuggets. So okay, and some gold nuggets. 
and I'm going to need a couple of drops of evil. Right, so let's make these can come out of here. Whoops. Can I have an angel ring? That's what I'm trying to make, buddy. And two leather. Um, who's got experience? Me. You have eight know. levels. Come and pull this out of this table. Now put it back in. Just put it in as the item. Cool. Just, yep, yeah, thank you. Awesome. Alright, so I've got... What did I say I had in this chest? I've got two golden... So I need one more bat and then... A couple of ghasts. Alright, I'm going to grab some arrows. I'm going to jump into the nether. I'm going to try and find a ghast. And I'll come back when I've got one. And hopefully we can get enough to make some rings and then we're going to need to have to work on power <laughs> don't have enough gold uh one of your kids needs to go mining for gold joy joy and uh i'll get the casts so we'll be back once we got the stuff see you in a minute i love being out of fly ow ah i got one <laughs> that's one Two more to go. Um, Dragon's having a hard time finding gold. <laughs> Found rose gold. Eh, that's not what we need. We need gold. I don't know if there's any nether gold. It's iron. We're gonna have a look around in the nether. See if I can find some. I don't. I don't think there is. Ooh, I hear another one. Where are you? Where are you, Mr. Ghast? Tell you what, though, it's it's nice having the the armor I've got. Um, although I would like to have the the health boost of the obsidian armor and the flight ring, that would be cool. I hear the I hear the gas somewhere. No, he's gone. He was over here somewhere. All right, I'm going to keep looking around. I'll see if I can get these other two. Why is there a wither skeleton here? Hey, come, buddy. Oh, got me. Got me. Your spider friends don't stand a chance. Alright. I'm going to find these ghasts. Where are they? Come on, show yourselves. There he is. Hey, how you doing? How you doing? That's two. One to go. One to go. All right. I'll, uh, I'll get one more ghast and we'll come back when when we've got that and some gold and we're ready to craft some rings. Back in a tick. Alrighty, we're back. I've caught the three ghasts. They didn't stand a chance. Here's our angel rings. So one for Manx or one for Dragon and one for Jamarella, even though Jamarella isn't here. We'll get them anyway. Cool. Let me go in there for the moment. Uh, so angel rings. Uh, for that, we're going to need some more grid power, right? So um, we're only produce. They these need thirty-two. So we need at least two water mills per angel ring, because the water mills produce sixteen. So I made up some stone burnt. I've got some cooking over here. I put a speed upgrade in there. It's using like twenty-four GP to to nail through that, but. That's all right. Here's the six we need, so two each. I'll take them out of there for now. That can go back to doing eight. So let's get some water. I mean, I, I could set them up downstairs, but I mean, it's, it's not a big issue. I just don't want to completely block things up. So let's just grab a few buckets of water. And we'll head downstairs. Because um, we've got a little bit of a setup here. Again, it doesn't matter where we put this. As long as it's somewhere that's in the world. Uh, let's see. Oh, I made myself a hammer too. Uh, so made this hammer here. It's it's copper uh, tough 
rod, a cobalt hammerhead, alamite large plate, and a cobalt large plate. I was trying to get the speed, but um, it didn't want to know. So I've only got a mining speed of 4.2. Uh, eventually this will get a bit faster. It's it's all right, and it also has Global Traveler. I've connected it to this ender chest here, so we don't have too much stuff getting in the way. Look, a cave. Wow. All uh, right. So let's stop the water flying back there. Maybe that'll minimise some lag. So we have. Maybe I just need to pick this whole lot up and move it somewhere else. You know what, let's do that. Let's global travel all them into the system. Oops. Anyway. Let's take them somewhere else. Um, mill. So we've got 10 of them. So we should be able to find a spot. Maybe we'll go up over the back here. And level out an area. I don't have, um, something I don't have yet is an excavator. That would be quite handy at the moment to clear a nice bit of area. Let's just do this. Now, I should be able to get a fairly decent pattern set up with these water mills. Um, we do almost like a figure eight type pattern. Get hungry there, buddy. Yes, Harry. <laughs> chomp, 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 chomp. I brought horses. You brought horses? Okay. The next to the cow shed. All right. So if we put, let's move our water mills down. If we put a water mill here, here. Let's not put it there. Let's put it. I'm trying to remember the. A good pattern. We'll wing it. We'll wing it. So we need flowing water on each of the four sides of these, and it's normally fairly easily done. Start with one side. So if I put water here, it's flowing past this one. And you can't you can't have a solid water next to it. You need to have flowing next to the sides. So if I put one that stop moving. Do, do, do. Okay, so that's not how we do it. This is only putting out five because it stopped. Let's pick that one back up. Eleven, huh? All right. Give me a minute. I'll uh, I'll get my pattern set up, and I'll be right back. And we're back. And I'm just cleaning up the uh, the design I got here. So I've just done nine, I think it is all up, and uh, in a you know multiplication or a, you know cross pattern. I'm uh, just putting some glass on here so like mobs don't get stuck. So I think Manx was saying there was a few here before while we were getting some other stuff done. So put some glass on top. Fairly straightforward. Um, you want a source block of water in the corners. And then in this spot here. Um, I think I've got two here. There's one here and one here. But... In this spot here on the four sides and then in the corners and that should give all of them 16 each so here you go buddy ring just put it in your inventory somewhere and you can fly go 
and go. Can't double jump. Oh, I'm gonna have to share GP. That'll do it. Um, so what we gotta do? We gotta go extra utility, extra utilities, power sharing. Um, okay, try now. Here, dragon. Ring on the ground. Can you fly? No. That's odd. Maybe because it doesn't have wings on it. It shouldn't matter. Whoa. Let's... Why can't I talk to this kid? I don't know. I can't do it either. Uh, okay, so I'm not sure why that's not working. There should be enough GP there now, and I've done power sharing. Um, can't even punch him. They should all be... I've got dragon wings. Does it fly though, buddy? Nope. <laughs> Oh, I'm not sure why it's not working. If I take one of these off, I shouldn't be able to fly. But I can fly. I'm, I'm using the, the angel ring. Um, hmm. I don't know. How about I stop flying and I put these two angel rings in this chest. What about now? Can you fly? This is very weird. Alright, well, I don't know what's going on there. I've made them all rings and they should be able to fly as far as I'm concerned. Um, maybe, right, come on, uh, maybe right click on something. Right click on the resonator. Can you open that? Yes. Okay. Hmm. A little bit odd. Because I have, I have sharing I'm, I'm doing the sharing so that's that's a bit strange so i might work in looking at doing this at some point soon the infinity catalyst is a bit that's going to be hard for us so we're going to need to get into uh, a bit of avaricia and make make the things we need so we're going to need the singularities so they're the things we're going to have to look into so we'll do that in the next episode we'll wrap up here thank you everyone for watching that system over there should work you know worst case one thing we probably could do is i could pick a couple of them up and then give two each to these guys and they could place them that might be a good way of doing it um maybe that's maybe that's a better option so we'll give that a go, but we'll do that off camera. Um, so yeah, thanks everyone for watching. Please leave your comments in the section below. I hope you come and join us in the next episode. See you later. Say goodbye, kids. Bye. Bye, Bye now.